Let's go, champ. Let's go, champ. I sleeping on you. I sleeping on you. I thought you was done. <laughs> yeah. Perspective drives performance. God got me. Best believe. God got me. That's a wrap. Workout number one. Three miles. Eight minute mile per pace. A little over eight minutes. I ain't gonna lie to you. But man, let's get it. First workout of the day. Start off on great note. Like I said, perspective drives performance. We're about to head to the second workout, which is a kettlebell workout, full body hit. Let's get it. When you come out of the storm, you won't be the same person that walked into it. That's what the storm is all about. When you can't control what's happening to you, control how you respond to it. That's where your power is. Working for it, not often you find riches. Some niggas find coffins, others just near leave you. You can't see the devil. Niggas go to college, niggas go to jail. Hey, to my son, on them papers with a firm hold on his gun. They ain't never coming home. They said I wouldn't make it. I never see the drugs. Just to Don't let your demons take you to hell. Introduce him to I'm praying for my son to get the scholarship. Uh -huh. A nice university, one of these black colleges. So yeah, that was workout two. You know what I'm saying? We did a full body workout, kettlebell. Took about 30 minutes. Um, right now we headed to back to the gym. So this will be workout three. But like, that's the difference, man. That's the difference. Been up since 5.30. It's 8 a.m. I'm two workouts in, about to be here. About to be on my third one. So it's like, that's the separation factor, is the consistency. Stop making excuses. Like, a lot of people go, oh, I can't wake up. I can't do this. I go to bed too late, blah, blah, blah. But at the end of the day, I'm just excuses. Like, you too comfortable being comfortable. Get out that bed. Like, today I woke up and I had an opportunity to get better. And I chose to make the most of it. But what do you do with your 24 hours? You know what I'm saying? Like, everyone has the same 24 hours in life. But we don't always view it like that. And that's what I was saying in the morning. Like, when I'm running, when I say perspective drives performance, you got to have that positive mindset. You got to understand that this life that we have is such a short, short lived thing that sometimes we take everything for granted. We take life for granted way too much. You gotta wake up with an attitude of gratitude. You gotta understand that you don't know when your time is. And it's like, I'm 25 and I think I can I can reach 100. I really think that I will reach 100 years old. So it's like, I'm only a quarter of the way into my life and I still got it. Like I said, if I think I'm gonna reach 100, I got 75 more years to leave an impact on this world. So what do you do? You know what I'm saying? How can I do that? Man, and it's just like, if I can share my story, if I can share my motivation, and I can touch people, it's powerful. Yeah, man, it's just, it's a little different one, man. I, I don't do that much talking, but, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna tell you what's on my heart today. That's the thing, it's like, you got two choices when you wake up. You can get up and go after your dreams, or you can sleep with your dreams. What you gonna do? I'm gonna get up and go after mine, best believe that. Best believe that, I'm gonna get up and go after mine. But yeah, so we headed to the gym, about to be under my third workout. So finish that, and later on, head back to the crib, grab something to eat. I got a couple clients for training. And we'll go from there. You might see a fourth workout today. It's crazy. This is the type of shit they go to my head. I'm hanging around with billionaires. Coffee of the day is loco coffee. Vanilla honey flavor. You know what I'm saying? I, I consider myself a coffee kind of sore. And I will say, as my boy LD would say, top tier, you need to go tap into this. Coffee with loco coffee. Coffee with benefits. Hey man, if y'all trying to sponsor the kid, holla at me, you know what I'm saying? We could definitely do some ETG Loco Coffee, you know what I'm saying? ETG times LC, 
Ooh, I like that. ETG CBC. Yeah. I might come up with my own flag. Y'all need to. We need to do something. Enhanced coffee beverage. We need that. We need, we need to get some emotion, man. Punch, hey, little light punch. Little light punch, Steve. Hmm. Rip, play. Hand off, hand off, hand off. Come on, let's do it. Uh-huh. Let's go, that's okay. Cash out. Deep, deep, deep. Look at that. Come on. Hey. Come on, man. Let me see. This dude acting camera shy. Look at him. Come out the road, man. Come on, dude. Come on. He playing. Man, so. What a day. Three workouts in. Started the morning off with a three mile run. Did a kettlebell workout, which was about 35 minutes. Uh, finished up with basketball, that was my third workout. Right now it's around 2.15, I believe. Don't have my watch on me, but I think about 2.15, so just about to have my first meal. I'm still on that animal-based diet. Um, love the results, my body feels good, my energy levels are really high, so right now I got five scrambled eggs, half avocado, little pink Himalayan salt, little pepper, smoothie. I think I got like every possible fruit you can possibly think of. So I'm about to eat this. Um, later on, I got, I only got one client today, personal training, but um, after that, I'll probably head to Lifetime, take you through a little stretching, um, sit in the sauna, steam room, just try to take care of that body. Um, but yeah, man, definitely a great day of work. My boy A Boogie, he coming in. We gonna see if he's scared. What's up, man? Say what's up. Say what's up to the YouTube fam. 
<laughs> Say what's up, dude. But yeah, so I'm about to eat this. And like I said, get on with the rest of the day. I'll check back in. Man, so I just pulled up the Lifetime. I'm sitting in the parking lot. And it's like, on the drive over here, I'm thinking about like what I kept saying. Perspective drives performance. And the power of positive energy. So it's like, the universe sends so many messages to us, but sometimes we live, we don't see them. Like we really don't see them. But when, you, when you're able to really tune in and be like, okay, what, what is God sending me? He's sending you messages that you have to grasp, you have to be able to understand and apply them and they're gonna help you along in your pathway of life. And it's like, when you think abundantly, everything is possible. Nothing is impossible. For instance, when things don't go your way, when you're dealing with adversity, challenges, traumatic experiences, like so many things in life, like we're not always gonna have a good day. But when we think about a seemingly negative event, that occurs, you begin to narrow your mindset and your thought process comes from narrowness and scarcity. You just have to be able to count your blessings, man. It's just like, be thankful for your family, be thankful for your friends. Like, again, life is such a short lived thing that we get so caught up that sometimes we lose track of who we are and what we do for why we do it. So I had to take myself outside my body, you know what I'm saying? And I put myself in Lil May's body. It's like, Lil May's looking at me saying, you know what I'm saying? Like, you don't believe in me? Like, where's that love? Where's that passion? I wanted everything you got and more. And it's like, damn. Like, you think about that and it's just like, Think about all, all, everything you went through to get to where you are today. It's a beautiful thing, man. It's just like, sometimes you just gotta shift your perspective, man. You gotta really think about it. You gotta think outside the box. And when you do that, man, you will see, you know what I'm saying? Abundant thinking, man. You gotta start doing it, man. Perspective drives performance. That's.